Hello friends, this is Ram. So in this video, we will see how to set up SD card as a default installation storage in Android phone. We often see error messages while installing new apps in Android phone that is insufficient storage space and etc. So you don't have to worry about running out of space on your phone. After doing this, your phone will automatically allow us to install new apps in your external memory. For this, we need to get Java JDK. So search in Google Java JDK. So select the first link, click on first link and here click on JDK download button. So here accept the license agreement and choose a file according to your operating system. So let us see how to check which operating system you are running. So press start button right click on my computer and properties so here windows 32 bit operating system i'm running so select a windows x86 means windows 32 bit operating system file now get on sdk so type in google on sdk so freeware on sdk and click on first link so here install the sdk click on install the sdk so here standalone sdk tools click on it we need to select windows supported file so click on it so and here also accept the license agreement and press download button i have already downloaded this both softwares so let us install both softwares on right sdk and java jdk so let us install both i already installed now observe carefully step by step now open the c drive and select users click on your pc name and select app data and here local and select on right and Android SDK here we need to open SDK manager on right SDK manager open so we need to install two more applications from SDK manager tool so that are on right SDK and on right SDK platform tools so mark both applications and click on install packages it will take a long time so I already did that so after this so open platform tools under Android SDK after this before connecting your Android phone to this PC you have to enable USB debugging mode in your Android phone so let us see how to enable tap on settings button and down below see the developer option under that USB uh, debugging uh, click on it yes enable it that's all so in Samsung phones and uh, other phones uh, you can also find in application manager don't forget to disabling the USB debugging mode in your Android phone after complete okay so now connect your Android phone to your PC so let me connect my Android phone I'm connecting here Moto E so yes so in this window we have to hold shift key and right click and open window command here so here we need to execute two uh, commands that is first one adb devices so we need to execute adb devices here just type in command from adb devices yes so press enter now so it will show you list of devices connected to pc and device code here i can see my device code here so that is ok that is fine successfully executed first command and next second command so let us type adb shell pm set uh, dash or slash uh, dash and or minus 
adb shell tm set minus install minus location 2 and press enter yes that's all friends no error message we got now enter exit uh, command to close yes congrats now your phone will allow to install apps to sd card directly by default thanks for watching friends if you have any doubts post in comments i will answer you and uh, hit like and share with your friends and also please subscribe my channel for more future updates thanks again